Hi guys, just a quick video to show you some projects that I've been doing. This one here is a little baby's onesie that I did using my Cricut Imagine and some just some regular iron-on transfer paper that you can get in um, a stationery store. And I literally just took the image, printed and cut it on the transfer paper in my Imagine using Nursery Tales, um, ironed it onto the little onesie. Um, sealed it by, you've got like another piece of paper which you iron on, I mean follow the instructions of each individual transfer paper that you, you know, happen to purchase, they presumably may vary on their instructions. That then sealed it and um, it's machine washable and everything. So, um, and actually I did a test one because I, um, I um, actually had a mark on one of the onesies so I did a test one on it and washed it and scrubbed it and all sorts once I put the image on and it didn't budge an inch so as you can see it's really really sweet so that's one of the things that I've been doing and then I've been also doing some Easter cards so we've got this cute little one here which again is just some toppers on an 8x8 card and bits of paper, you know, just cutting up and basically just putting together really um, in a pretty design. Sorry, I'm wobbling. I'm on my iPhone because my camera, um, actual video camera's run out of battery. And this is a trifold card. So um, as you can see with that sort of scallop shape, not scallop, that kind of, sorry, the shadow, that oval sort of shape there. So it sort of folds out in threefold and it's got more images on the back there as well and then this is sort of an Easter -y card um, it's just a cute stamp which uh, my favorite you know my little house mouse and then a little verse and some jewels which is really sweet I um, like that one then we've got again house mouse decoupage but on this particular one I um, as you can see I've um, used the flower soft on the little chicks and also I don't know if you can see if I go in really close there's little tiny beads for the seed I'm to do it so I'm not making a shadow <laughs> there you go so that's the little beads on there and then another little house mouse one with a bunny just saying happy Easter a very bright and cheerful one here just again really simple it's just a little topper and some paper and off you go and again another one there but we used a lovely little embellishment here just to add a little bit of bling bling to it and then this one is using the Debbie Moore Easter Bear CDs which is it's actually um, stands up like that if you can see it from that angle um, but if I fold it back down you can see it a little bit better um, and then you just cut out all the elements that you want uh, even the actual card base is on there as a template and then I just added these flowers as extra I'd love to say I made them but I didn't and a bit of glitter around the edges here so that was all printed out that one which I thought was quite pleased with that and then on my imagine um, we did the little dynamite card here, little um, that's using my pink stamper stamps, and just cut out my little dinosaur. I think that was on either create. I think that was creator critter or I'm not sure. I think it was creator critter. Anyway, the little dinosaur, and I used um, the Imagine art cartridge uh, nature. The um, Kind of like real images one where it's got, and I used to and I used the grass as well so I used like the stone and everything for the little dinosaur and then the grass down the bottom and just ripped and tore to make the sort of hills and mountains on that one and then we've just been making a few little fairy cards from the flower fairies and this is from your crafter's companion um, kit so And on these, just to show you, I've been using um, the CD-ROM to do the inserts that match. So that's got the matching insert, and so 
So there's that. Shuddering in here, it's horrible. Sorry. Okay. And on this one. And again, a matching. Sorry, guys. Uh, a matching insert there. Uh, so that's where we are, but I really wanted to show you, the main thing I wanted to show you was my little onesie, because I thought that was so cute. So um, we will show you some actual craft projects again soon, but I just wanted to show you a few bits and pieces that I've been up to lately. Um, sorry it's on the iPhone and it's a bit wobbly, um, but I didn't realise my camera wasn't charged. So hopefully it doesn't make you too seasick. Alright guys, speak to you again soon and thanks for watching. Bye!